Oh, wild guess. Oh my God. I didn't realize that this was gonna get really deep here on Delish. Welcome to Are You Smarter Than a Pro Chef? In this show, I'm gonna go head to head with your favorite people on the internet. We're gonna see who's wiser, who knows more Oh! Ooh. And you know, in the end, nobody wins anything. My inaugural guest today is Binging with Babish's Andrew. Hey, what's up guys? My name is Andrew Ray. I make a show called Binging with Babish, and today I'm going to play Are You Smarter Than a Pro Chef? Where I'm gonna go head to head against a delish test kitchen chef. 10 questions that are going to get increasingly difficult. Oh my God, oh, Julia. God. Let's see who knows more than the other person. What's up, Andrew? Nice to see you through the YouTubes. Nice to meet you, very, uh, uh, sorry, let's do that again. <laughs> no second takes, this is it, this is real TV. We're rolling. June, nice to meet you, and uh, are you ready to win? <laughs> I'm also ready to lose. I think that's a good rule of thumb to go by. That's how I like to live my life. Like, I'm ready to win, but I'm also very ready to lose. But today, I'm especially ready to lose. Let's do it! I have every color of the rainbow here. What color ought I be? You can be all of them. I'm gonna go with purple. I don't know about you. Well, purple. Did you pick purple too? Oh, okay, all right. Okay, no, you picked it first. I'm sorry. I will go. Out of all of these colors. No, we're doing purple. No take backs. That's it. Head to head. Oh my god. I know one at least. I'm getting at least one point. <laughs> I can't see yours. Oh, there we go. Yeah. All right. That's so easy. Were we supposed to write out Come three? <laughs> Hit is harder. Oh my god. Oh no. Why? This is according to the USDA, of course, and the USDA wants to keep you safe, but at what cost? Oh, I am wrong. I thought the USDA <gasps> were real psychos about it. I didn't realize you could do 145. Okay. I believe well, 165 is chicken, my friend. That chicken. is chicken. I didn't get my food handler certificate for nothing eight years ago. Oh, uh, she's certified? I'm not certified. This is rigged. Go ahead. <laughs> Whoa, okay. This is a guess, but I feel like it's a very educated guess. Okay. Yeah, all right. We know what <laughs> my favorite meat is that hurts the planet the most. Guys, just eat beans. Produce the farts yourself. Don't let the cows do the dirty work for you. Listen, I love beans just as much as beef, just like everybody else. <laughs> Whoa. Man, I studied French and I don't even know this. Oh God, I know this. I was gonna say pot potage. Oh, wild guess. Dang. Yes. I got a four in AP French and I don't know how. I took seven years of Spanish and <laughs> still have the conversational ability of a very self-centered three-year-old. Oh my God, oh, Julia. God. Um, that's brutal, okay. That is brutal. Does it have to be exact? Oh, tie. <laughs> Dead heat, all right. Maybe this is the moment we realize we're the same person. I was worried this was gonna happen. I've seen Fight Club. <laughs> oh my oh, gosh. In 10 seconds, are you mad? This is rig. <laughs> I can't write that. Yeah, me either. Aw. No, I just finished writing it. I got the I got the lyrics to the song. I got four. It's, it's a Scarborough Fair. Parsley, sage, rosemary, thyme. Yeah, Jesus. yeah, I know there's a lot of herbs. Dude! You can't write, <laughs> that is one and a quarter seconds to I'm write sorry. a word. <laughs> That's I'm not insane. a machine, okay? Right. I've never heard this before. Uh, 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 sprinkle. I said sprinkle with parsley. I think she gets, yeah, I think that's hers. I think that belongs to June. That is nice, nicely done. You know, I worked in the restaurant industry for four and a half years and I've never heard that phrase ever, so. 
I worked in a restaurant one day and cut my thumb so bad they fired me on the spot. Damn, usually they just tell you to suck it up and keep bleeding into the food. Oh, they did. They did. I finished the lunch rush, then they fired me. <laughs> That's the restaurant industry I know and love. All right, come on, Amy. Redemption round. I said no cocoa salads. Yo, nice. All right. Whew. Three materials that are considered reactive. Ooh. Okay, okay. We need more than 10 seconds. Okay. Ah, she got it. And I did not. I said nonstick, which I think I said in my mind is, isn't nonstick reactive though? I mean, what? is non-stick though, because non-stick is just the bonding that you put on top of your metal, right? Yeah, but you can't get like non-stick copper or you can't get like non-stick. I thought like hard anodized pans were, re were reactive. Hang on. <laughs> Listen, Andrew, look, I've been cooking on my Ikea pots that I bought for $14 about eight years ago when I was even more broke. And uh, you know, that tells you how much I know about pots. Non-stick is non-reactive, I see. Oh God. Oh, oh. No, no, no. I, this I do not know. I don't know either. So I'm making a joke. I just know that it's a um, random bunch of letters. I mean, comment down below if you know what EFR stands for, because I sure as hell don't. I just wrote it. In the grand scheme of things, if I'm not the same person as you, I still lost. What a kind and very mean thing to say about yourself. I appreciate it, but I... <laughs> I just want the universe to become one. Like, I need the singularity to happen right now. I didn't realize that this was gonna get really deep here on Delish, but I agree. I think that we should merge into the singularity. I think 2021 is the year that we do it. This has been Delish Original Programming. Andrew, thank you so much for taking time out of your fantastic life and busy schedule to join me in answering these silly questions. I hope y'all learned something. And I hope y'all learned that Andrew is fantastic, more than you thought he was. Maybe next time we'll do a rematch and we'll figure out that we're actually the same person because, you know, singularity. Thank you so much, Delish, for having me. Thank you for throwing me a bunch of softballs so I didn't look like a complete dingus. If you want more Binging with Babish, go check out my channel, Binging with Babish, where I recreate foods from movies and television. And my Babish cookware line is available now on Amazon. Go check it out. And thank you, June, for being awesome and for promoting the singularity, which is something that people are just learning that I'm a believer in. 2021, we're gonna make it happen, guys. <laughs>